Hey guys, so today I want to talk to you about your season of singleness. If you're single right now, like myself, and you've also been in a frustrating situation trying to find somebody who's like-minded, who's looking for something long-term, who's willing to be faithful, to be respectful, to commit to you, um, and to uh, progress towards something serious, then this video is for you. So let's get into it. Your season of singleness, this should be the time to focus on you. Get the things together that you want to, to have together when that mate comes along. You don't have to wait until you find somebody to get yourself together. A lot of people use this time and take it for granted. But this is the time, this is the last bit of time. If you are dating dating towards purpose, dating towards you know a real meaningful relationship that will ultimately lead to marriage. If you're in that position, use this time wisely. This is the last bit of time that you'll have to do all the things that you want to do. Take that trip, get your credit score together, secure the bag, as they say. You know, get your finances in order, progress in your career, make a change within your career that, you know, that you're gonna benefit from in the future. Don't wait until you meet somebody. I know a lot of women who are, I mean, great catches. I'll be honest with you, they have their minds right, they got a good education, they have a great job. Um, some of them who are mothers, they're great mothers to their children. Um, but at the same time, it's really, really hard to find somebody that's good for them and compatible and who, are, who can also be a good role model for their kids. But instead of focusing on that, because that right there, you just keep bumping your head and bumping your head. I had to learn this the hard way for myself. Continuing to date and not getting anything in return. Having my time wasted by people who weren't looking for the things that I was looking for. So instead of that, use this time wisely. Do all the things that you've been wanting to do. Use this time to, like I said, get your credit score together, uh, get your mental together, be what you want to attract. A lot of people are around here looking for things that they don't even possess in themselves. You want someone with good credit, who has a nice car, who owns property or owns their own home, but you don't possess any of those things. So instead of waiting on that person to come along and hoping that they can help you, you know, manifest some of your dreams, do that now. Do it for yourself so it'll be more rewarding when it comes down to it. And ladies, lastly, we have to stop looking for a man to complete us, looking for a man to validate who we are as a woman. If you know that you're a good woman, if you got a good career, if you got a good head on your shoulders, if you got your finances in order, credit score together, you already know that you're a good catch. You don't need anybody to validate you. And just because you have a man around, that doesn't mean anything. You should be good all by yourself. Because I tell you what, you get in a relationship with somebody and you don't already feel that self-love within yourself, they're not going to complete you. You'll never believe that they love you because you don't even love yourself. And if you don't love yourself, how can anybody else love you to the capacity that you'll actually feel that's genuine? So that's my word for today. Whatever it is that you're struggling with right now, I suggest you focus on that. Stop focusing on the next guy and you know if he's gonna be a good catch stop banging your head up against the wall I've done it too many times so I can tell you from experience use this time wisely use your season of singleness to work on you to better yourself queen get yourself together sis you don't have to wait until you find somebody else hoping that they'll complete you you should be complete all by yourself when you meet somebody so marinate on that I hope that that helps you guys and I hope that you have an awesome Sunday and a great rest of the weekend peace